So we got here Eco Zoom. What it is, it's a rocket stove. Let's open it up. If you're a doomsday prepper and like cooking outside, this is probably something that you would like. So it looks like a little bucket and inside over here, there's two openings right here. So if you like living off grid and stuff like that, that's something you would like to have for sure. You can use charcoal or you can use little sticks. When you're using charcoal, it's obvious, it's really easy. Just load it up, light it up and it's ready to go. But when you use sticks, this is what you need. We're going to put it like that. So this is where you would put sticks in here. And this little piece right here, it's for the oxygen. This is how the rocket stove work. Oxygen come from here. You put all the candle and then sticks into here and fire coming off from over here. So let's actually put this to the test. We're gonna use sticks instead of charcoal. That way it's a little bit harder to do. Charcoal is too easy. And when you off grid, you probably don't even have any charcoal. You probably all you have is candle and then sticks. And then I'm gonna put little pieces inside of it. And as you can see, we don't wanna forget to keep this open to keep the fire going. As you can see it's burning. Give it some time. As you can see a big opening over here so you can put pretty nice pieces. So once we get it going as well, really well, we can just put close this top ones and keep this open. And the fire is gonna be even better. Honestly so far it's beaten my expectation. Now I'm gonna move to the bigger pieces. Wow, look at it. It's so deep, look how it's about like 10 inches. It goes almost all the way. And of course I want to mix it up. Big pieces, small pieces, at the same time. Wow, look at it go. And when you need to push it in, just use another stick to keep pushing it in. This is beautiful. Gonna add a couple more pieces. So now I got here a full pot of water. I don't really have a good pot right now. We're gonna set it right here. And look how well it does. You see those little three legs right here? Any kind of pot will fit on it. And look at this. Just few inches from here so all the fire will heat it. And you see we got here almost full pot of water. Let's see how fast can we boil it. I know it's not really the pot to boil water in. You see, looks like the paint is coming off. So I'm not really going to cook with this water. It's just to test it out. I didn't really have a pot. I need to buy more pot. Looks like it's burning off. Just push it in. Push, put another piece really easily. Look at that. It stays easy. You see, nothing have fall off on the bottom here. Just all that wood stays there. And all the ash, you see, goes over there pretty awesome love it fully boiled look how much it's bubbling that's how you tell it's fully boiled honestly 10 minutes that's all it took us look how beautiful this is though i love this stuff eco zoom very efficient very few sticks that used do you see it only one piece of stick left water look how much water there is so it's boiling violently still boiling so we can definitely make even a soup on it. We can keep boiling water with this for a while, that's for sure. Oh, wow, this is awesome. Check this out. Wow, this is a 